So I had the idea for this simple communication device roughly three years ago. I was hanging out at my friend's house in Oslo and his son wanted to go outside and play, but wasn't allowed to. We were making dinner and the son had already lost and broken a smartphone. So my friend said, why can't you just go to your room and play with an iPad instead? And I thought that was so sad. When I was growing up in Memphis, I was out playing all the time. So I thought, why is there no simple communication device on the market? Like a one button walkie talkie type thing on the cell network. And that's when I invented TinyTel. It's a simple one button mobile phone for kids. It's very simple. It's just got this one big button. You press the big button and it calls a contact list that's in standby. You can have 12 contacts in it and you manage it all from a smartphone app. So mom and dad have the peace of mind from the smartphone app. They can see where the kid is, they can manage the contacts. If it answers calls automatically, who can call Tinitel? Beyond just a simple mobile phone, it's also a tracking device. So parents can keep track of where their kids are. They see that in the app and thanks to Tinitel's GPS technology. When I got started with working on this project, I immediately looked for different uh, technology platforms on which I could build Tinitel. At that same time, MediaTek was launching something called MediaTek Labs. And MediaTek Labs uh, was working on a new chip only for wearables uh, called the Astro chip. And with the Astro chip, I could make uh, this thing. It's the world's smallest mobile phone. That was my involvement with MediaTek Labs. They helped me find suppliers, and uh, in a month, we're about to launch uh, with telcos and the Nordics, and uh, 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 shortly thereafter in the UK. We've been developing this product for roughly six months now. So what we can see here on, on the TinyTel device is it's just got this big button. That's for, for making phone calls, for uh, uh, ending phone calls, uh, for scrolling through the contact list. You have this, uh, this plus and minus button here that uh, you use to scroll through the different contacts. Uh, you have a speaker and a microphone. And uh, on this side here, you have uh, the SIM card. It's got two to three hours of speech, depending on how far away you are from the cell towers, and uh, 150 hours of pure standby time. So right now, we're doing it all on our website. We're accepting pre-orders there. Uh, it costs $129, just the unit. And then the customer is gonna have to get their own SIM card, because we don't, we don't supply SIM cards at this stage. And when we launch, we'll be launching with selected telcos in the UK and in the Nordics and Germany and the USA and so forth.